OK guys, this is the last post for the weekend. Uh, I've got to go back to work on Monday, which means the next post is not going to be until the following weekend. Um, my last series of videos was a bit technical. I do apologise for that, but uh, it's an ongoing project. Um, I do eventually want to see it through to completion because I did have that lead working fully and properly some years back and I fully intend to get it working again but uh, anyway this video um, you may if you've watched the last video and if you haven't I don't blame you <laughs> um, but you may have noticed in the directory that I pulled up uh, from the disk was a little file called Spectrum yes it is a Spectrum emulator for the Commodore 64 something you may or may not have seen before. I've just fired it up on the old uh, WinVice emulator here. So if you just have a look... There we are. Spectrum. It was made by... or uh, well, programmed I should say, by a company called Whitby Computers way back in the day. Um, the only downside is it does emulate Spectrum perfectly but it only emulates Spectrum Basic. The Commodore 64 was never fast enough to um, emulate another processor. It was only barely fast enough to run its own 6502, sorry 6510 or the 85 series in the, in the uh, Plus version. Uh, it could never hope to emulate a Z80 processor which ran much faster natively, if I remember, than the Commodore 64 did anyway. Uh, even with a CPM cartridge which had a Z80 processor built in, it still could not fully emulate a Spectrum. However, Whitby Computers did a very, very good job of emulating Spectrum Basic. Um, they made it look like the Spectrum when it but when it uh, fires up and it has all the all the beep commands and everything and it tried its best to emulate the um, the memory model as well there we go copyright 1985 so you can see how old it is um, just press a key there it is border zero click and bearing in mind this is running on a 64 okay it's an emulator but it will run on the real thing as well but it's a Commodore 64 emulating a ZX Spectrum BASIC um, long time since I've used this, I can't remember what the keys are now order next, pause that one, that one well you get the idea anyway um, print this is a Commodore 64. There it is. <laughs> uh, just an entertaining little uh, program, which I thought I'd dig out for you guys to look at, in case you'd never seen it before. I was absolutely amazed back in the day when I came across this one. Um, print. God, it's a long time since I've programmed BASIC. No, no. That's the one. Uh, sorry guys, I just had to dig this out of the archives to show you. Just as an out for the weekend. Um, what's left of the weekend? Have fun, enjoy it. And uh, by the way, Techromancer1, glad to see you back, buddy. Missed you, missed the show. Hope everything goes well for you. And by the way, how's the car coming along? Be interested to see. Catch you all later, guys.